Having participated in our recent Great Telco debate session on Edgenomics, VMware's VP of Service Provider Marketing, Stephen Spellacy, joins us to dig a little deeper into the edge opportunities for CSPs and to find out how VMware can support service providers as they transform their operations and customer relationships. So Stephen, great to talk to you again. Um, it almost goes without saying that the global pandemic of the past two years or so has disrupted the way we live and work. Has this impacted the way we think about building networks and services as well? And if so, what are the implications? Ray, it's great to be here today. Well, it goes without saying there's been a massive amount of learning over these last few years. We've had to rethink our approach completely to how we operate, and it's required a real shift in mindset to a highly distributed model. And what we're seeing in this industry and in every vertical we talk to is that they've had to morph overnight. And perhaps one of the most essential to change has been telecom. And as a result of this transformation, uh, CSPs have learned that they're, they need to modernize their networks in order to address and optimize the kinds of services, those that are latency sensitive, such as you know, video conferencing and streaming media. And, and they need to do this in, at, a, at a very vast scale in order to meet the new demands of the new reality. Uh, that there's also been an imbalance from that central to de decentralized um, perspective. And we, we're now we're operating in a highly distributed design. And overnight, there's been a hyper dispersion of user access that really no telco operator planned for. So essentially, the network that we have now isn't the one that we need. As a, a cent, you know, with all these millions of new applications that are cropping up and, and these new services that are coming you know, rapidly overnight, we need to think more edge in versus core out in the traffic patterns and also rethink and maybe replan, redesign for a much different communication pattern wherein latency and proximity have emerged as an absolute top requirement. So uh, if the historical approaches are becoming uh, less relevant, what should we be focusing on as an industry? Ray, we see huge upside for the CSP industry. You know, solving these challenges for CSPs and realizing the opportunity, it spans from a wide range of technologies, connectivity for both fixed and wireless, as well as security, device and application lifecycle management. It's all about deploying and automating and then orchestrating cloud native into 5G services. This is a this is a big challenge for operators, but it's a huge opportunity. Now, if we roll that up into two key areas, we see the new reality of this world being both multi-cloud and living on the edge. And I'll say it again, our world has become and is now more than ever multi-cloud and more precisely, it's not just multi-cloud, it's cross-cloud. You know, the resources that reside across these clouds require a much deeper understanding of how the network behaves in order to support the kind of applications that are running on it. And it's also become apparent that we're living on the edge. And from the location of the user, the data, the kind of network communications we have, and the requirements that are changing rapidly to host a new set of edge-based immersive style applications. These are modern applications. They're born at the edge. We actually call them edge native, and they have a dramatically different characteristic when compared to traditional legacy applications. So CSPs have to rethink and reimagine how to deploy these new services to the enterprise as well as to consumer mobile. We're all living in this new reality. So uh, a clear focus on multi-cloud and edge is obviously vital right now, uh, but as you say, there's a lot of technology and management complexity in, in making these a reality. How does VMware turn that vision and those challenges into a product strategy? Well, in, in a nutshell, we're innovating for our customers in three key areas, and this is pervasive in our, in our portfolio. First, it's all about cloud native app platforms. And th this is where I like our Tensu uh, Kubernetes infrastructure is crucial. It's a carrier grade infrastructure, K8s uh, for telecom and enterprises alike. Second, it's cloud infrastructure, such as our VMware cloud offering, which is our core capability to deliver the VMware experience across any cloud anywhere. And then thirdly, it's securing the edge, which is enabling our customers to innovate at the edge. And it's allowing them to be anywhere which empowers that anywhere workforce. Now, across all of these areas, we're providing industry leading cloud management, a faster path to zero trust security, and we're protecting the environment 
and our you know our comprehensive virtual networking portfolio as well as our cloud native platforms are enabling enterprises and mobile subscribers to connect using any device, any application, and to be able to access their data from anywhere. And finally, what are the main trends you see in the CSP sector? Uh, and what should service providers do to enhance their strategies? We believe CSPs are, have to really rethink how they approach this new reality you know, that we've been discussing throughout today. And it's only possible with a foundation that's cloud native, that's multi-cloud and that has secure edge capabilities. Now, the approach here for the CSP is to empower them to do what they do best, which is to provide and sell network services and solutions to their subscribers. CSPs who are going to follow this path can improve how they both operate and also speed the time to innovation, which is going to deliver this on a consistent model for leveraging cloud. And it's gonna be able to do that, do that at their fingertips. And essentially what we're talking about here is CSPs unleashing a wave of creativity that's going to help them transform themselves as well as their customers' environments. Ultimately, this is a mindset change where CSPs can safely and efficiently modernize their network, which is going to enable them to move to the next G much more fastly and in a highly secure and scalable way. Two, it's going to allow them to reimagine what's possible with an act to, you know, accessing a plethora of value-added 5G services that are capable only as cloud-native and multi-cloud architecture. And then thirdly, they can explore a path to innovation that enables them to more efficiently operationalize and monetize new capabilities for their consumer mobile and enterprise customers. If CSPs get this right, right, there'll be a host of value-added services out there that they can deliver and, you know, we know that there are 80 plus million workloads alone that are finding their way from the on-premise data center to the edge to the cloud. The time is now. The opportunity is here. OK, well, I think the CSPs also recognize that op opportunity and are working hard to grasp it. Stephen, thanks very much for giving us an update on what VMware is doing and thinking. Great to talk to you again. Thank you. Likewise, Ray. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.